All Access Life recently reached out to me and asked if I could create a Nerf gun that can be controlled with just your face. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how I did it. Okay, so what we're going to do is open up the gun, figure out how it works, and then try to switch adapt it. So here we go. The good thing is that I actually don't need to fully open this thing. I can see all the parts that I need to. This small little black button, that gets pushed every time you pull the trigger. So there's two wires coming off that. I'll solder onto those. And then the on and off switch over here, I can add an adapter onto those two wires coming off. And that's all there is. So I soldered onto the on and off switch and I also soldered onto the trigger button, just extension cables, so that when you uh, connect these two wires or put a switch in here, it will control the same thing as the on and off switch. All right, so we got the gun switch adapted. And you can see there are two 3.5 millimeter ports coming off. One of them I plugged into the button. One controls the power, the other controls shooting. So if I turn the power on, every time I push the button, oh boy. All right, so now that we've got this thing switch adapted, we've got to figure out how to mount it. So I actually created this kind of expanding robot a few years ago that helps people push buttons. What I'm gonna try to do is get this gun installed onto this one degree of freedom axis over here. I'm gonna take out the side motors. So all it needs to do is go right and left. So I attach this 3D printed piece onto the gun so that it can snap onto this turret over here. Now I just gotta work on the electronics for it, which I have laid out here. Um, I think these are the parts that I'll need. Uh, the microcontroller, some relays, um, a power cord, two of these mono cables, and then something to connect to the servo. Uh, let's get going. So now that we got the electronics set up, the next thing we need to do is get a way to connect the electronics to the gun so that it looks okay. I'll 3D design a case so that you can sit it just over there behind the gun. So let me show you what that looks like. So here you can see the 3D design that I created using Tinkercad and all the electronics are gonna sit in here and this is where the servo motor will be and this piece over here is going to connect to the tripod. Now I made these small holes in the side, so hopefully we can use zip ties to secure all the wires that are coming off of it. All right, so it finally printed. Let's give it a go. Okay, so I got the Nerf gun mounted on a turret system and it's getting signals through the iPhone, through the face gesture app. So when I move my head to the side with my eyebrows raised, the gun will do the same. So I can control the gun just by moving my head side to side if my eyebrows are raised, just like that. And if I smile, it will shoot. All right, the gun is finally finished. All the motors are connected, all the wiring is done, the 3D printing. So I'll send it in the mail and we'll try it out.